Hello everybody and welcome to your weekly gaming update coming to you courtesy of Rogue Gaming. Once again we're checking in this time for the week of August 8th 2018. We Happy Few is finally leaving early access and launching on the PC, PS4, and Xbox One this week. This is a twisted action adventure game where you play as one of three characters in a dystopian 1960s city following World War II. The government keeps people on a drug called Joy that keeps them unaware of what's really happening in the world. You, as a character, stop taking yours and start to see the truth. And the truth is very dark and twisted. This game's drawn a lot of comparisons to the Bioshock series for both its tone and style, and there's already a film version in the works. Dead Cells is also leaving early access this week and launching on the PC, PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and Nintendo Switch. This is a roguelike metroidvania with randomly generated stages for you to explore. The action is based on exploration and a fast-paced combat system. You'll be exploring this world and collecting a wide variety of weapons, but if you die, you're going to lose them all and have to start from the beginning. However, as you defeat enemies, you'll collect cells that you can use to purchase upgrades that are permanent for your character. Finally this week, the first sign of fall is here as Madden 19 is launching for the PC, PlayStation 4, and Xbox One. This is EA's annual NFL game, and this year, Antonio Brown is gracing the cover. The game is touting improved running and catching mechanics as the major improvements for this year's edition. Longshot Mode, the game's story-like campaign, is returning as well and allows you to continue your previous story. The game also has some improved animation and the Ultimate Team Mode will return which will allow you to create a fantasy squad of all Hall of Fame players. If you'd like more information on any of these games and a whole lot more, make sure you check out Rogue-Gaming.com.